Hi, today we will go for protein metabolism or the digestion of the protein in the human body. First of all, we will see the digestion in the stomach and next we will see the duodenum and in the jejunum or ileum. This is the part of the small intestine. First of all, uh, protein digested in the stomach. Actually, in the gastric juice or the HCL or the hydrochloric acid is secreted from the gastric juice which acts upon this pepsinogen. Is it, this is the pro-enzyme. This is the pepsinogen is the pro-enzyme which is present in the stomach and this HCL activator activates this pepsinogen to form the pepsin. This is the active enzyme to form pepsin which on further autocatalysis it becomes more pepsin. More pepsin is formed in the stomach. When we take protein diet, uh, suppose uh, meat, fish, protein diet, when we take this protein, this pepsin which is formed from the pepsinogen, this pepsin in the acidic medium at pH 1.6 to 3 point or uh, at ideal level this is the 2.0 pH, this acts upon this protein materials to form proteoges and peptones. These are the smaller fragments of proteins. This is the smaller fragments which is degraded from the protein materials. Next, this uh, this uh, digestion of the protein, these proteoges and peptones, this is smaller fragments of the protein, come to the duodenum. This is the first part of the small intestine of the human body. In this duodenum, what happens? Three, three in, pro enzymes are there. First one is the trypsinogen, and another is the chemotrypsinogen, and another is the procarboxypeptidase. These are the three pro enzymes present in this pancreatic juice. What happens? Enterokinase is the activator. Enterokinase is, is secreted from the intestinal juice. This acts upon this trypsinogen to form the trypsin. And also this enterokinase uh, trips, acts upon this trypsinogen to form trypsin. And the another two proenzymes called the chemotrypsinogen and the procarboxypeptidase acts upon this trypsin to form polypeptides and amino acids. Here you can see I have written peptones and the proteoges which are formed in this stomach. They act upon this trypsin in the alkaline medium. Remember that this is the acid, acidic medium and this is the alkaline medium trypsin to form polypeptides and the amino acids. This amino acid, this is the last material of the protein digestion to form amino acids. It's polypeptides and the amino acids. In the last or the secondary part of the small intestine, this is the jejunum and the ileum. In this jejunum and ileum, what happens? The peptides which are formed after the uh, chemotrypsinogen and procarboxypeptides, this acts upon this trypsin alkaline medium to form small peptides and which on further action to form amino acids. This is the last degradatory part of the protein metabolism and this is all about the protein metabolism or the protein digestion of protein in the human body. Protein is uh, digested or from the stomach, at first from the stomach to the small intestine which is completed in the protein, uh, which, uh, which is completed in the small intestine. So this is all about the protein metabolism.